Now, even if you're new to gymnastics and you've never seen it, but you've decided to sort of keep up with this approach to the Olympics, just think for a moment what she's doing. Think about whether you could even approach a thought of doing it, and then just watch it and appreciate it for what it is. So watch this. This is amazing. Tumbling the beam. And there's not much left. Maybe an inch. thing that I find so amazing is just a year ago, it, you know, everybody was talking to her about how great she was and she was saying things like, I can't believe it. It feels like a dream. It doesn't seem like it's really me, but I'll tell you, she doesn't have any of that look at all. I and mean, she knows that she is, she's the best. And, <laughs> and the other thing, Tim, that she does, every competition that she's in, she approaches it with a clean slate. She does not carry over any of her past results, including world championships, any American Cup wins, every event, clean slate. She does one of the most difficult beam dismounts, a, a double back with a full twist. And that is a good one to have done. Say that like Bella would. That was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she's phenomenal. Check this out. This is tumbling down the beam with all the speed that you would on the floor exercise. And, you know, there's not a lot of room for error here. Check this out. Just a little <laughs> bit of balance beam left right that, behind her. That is crazy. And this is a, a back with a full twist. And it is perfect. Like I said, this dismount, one of the most difficult in the world. Double back and watch, there's a full twist and just a small step at the end. The only visible error. Spectacular in every way. And she just seems to do it time after time after time. And that's a big part of the mission, consistency. Meanwhile, some concern, not for Sean Johnson, 16.25, that's a home run.